But Waukesha County is also kicking off the school year today. 12 News' is Madison Moore reporting live outside of Rose Glen Elementary School in Madison. The district is actually dealing with a bus driver shortage. Yeah, they are, Deanna. Waukesha School District actually notifying parents late last week that nine of the bus routes were still without a bus driver, leaving parents across the district and here at Rose Glen scrambling before the first day of school today. I mean, that's never happened before. I was shocked. I mean, I was pretty perturbed. It's a little frustrating because we found out, you know, a few days before school. A 10th route won't have a bus driver until next week, and some of the others will run late, all due to a first student staffing shortage. The district says they already worked with first student to reduce the number of bus routes from 87 to 68 this year and have minimized the impact to five of their 22 schools. Parents calling it a chaotic start to the school year. We usually take them on the first day, but just kind of scrambling for the rest of the week to figure out um, how we're going to get the kids there. I had to change around my work schedule. My husband had to change around his so he can pick her up after work and all of that. So it's definitely crummy with her being a kindergartner. That was the whole experience. We've talked about her going on the bus for the last four months, you know, to get her ready and stuff like that. So it's a bummer. Now, we did reach out to the district for an interview. They were not available today, but they tell us that administration is being flexible with parents on pickup and drop off times as they know this is an inconvenience. They also add that first student is actively hiring and training new drivers. Deanna. All right, yeah, not the way that we want to kick off the school year there in Waukesha. Some bus routes canceled, others delayed, impacting a lot of families. Madison Moore reporting live for us in Waukesha.